Hey guys, it's me Shby, and today I will be reviewing the Lego Minifigure Series 23. These guys are going to be coming out on the 1st of September, and in this video I'll be giving you all of my thoughts and opinions on these, so let's get to it. Number one, we have the Robot Girl. I think this is really, really, really nice. I like the headpiece that you can actually stick Lego pieces to it from the left, right, and top. I also really do like the colouring of this minifigure. I think it's quite bold and really nice. And I do also like the printing of everything. I just think it's a really, really good job on Lego's behalf. I, I also do love the accessories of scissors. And I'm guessing that's a computer. Oh, it's not a computer, is it? I don't know what that is. But whatever it is, it's really good. Second is the Fairy Captain. I do really like this figure from like the face and the captain's hat. The captain's hat is just spot on. It's like absolutely perfect. The only thing I don't like about this figure is the boat just looks a little plain. If it had a few more colours in it, it would be perfect, but it's just quite basic. I think instead of going for like black, white and red, they could they should keep that. Maybe like if they could add more detailing, maybe I don't know, but just more detailing. And he could have like a small accessory. I don't know what that accessory could be, but he could have a little bit more just to make him sort of the perfect figure. Next up, we have Reindeer Girl. I really, really like this figure because, I mean, what don't you like about this figure? It's got nice printing on the torso. The, how do you call it? The headpiece is really, really nice. Um, and I like how they're reusing the presents from 2018 in series 18, um, but just in a different colour, because I don't think that colour's actually quite a common colour in Lego. I think it's quite cool that they're sort of bringing that colour back, because I don't think I've seen it that much, or maybe... I'm just really outdated with Lego. Who knows? Uh, the next one, I really don't like this figure, just because I think this this figure is probably quite lazy on Lego's behalf because um they've just reused the series 18 dragon guy pieces, but just put it in a different colour. So I thought I was quite lazy on Lego's behalf. I mean, some people may really really like this figure, and also others might hate it. So next figure. Right, this guy, Popcorn Dude, I think he is absolutely amazing. So, I just love everything from the headpiece to the, like, mini legs to the face. The only thing I wish about this figure is if he had a popcorn bucket accessory. I mean, I think that would be perfect. I think I would be buying 20 of those figures if he had a popcorn bucket as an accessory. I just think that would be absolutely brilliant. It would just make that figure, like, that extra bit better it would just like knock it out of the park that figure so next one next we have the wolf guy i really really like this figure i just think all of the detailing is just well chef's kisses um another thing i really really like about this is that they've actually taken the time and they've edited the sort of garbage bag that he's holding because traditionally that's just plain but i just love it that they've done it for this minifigure series Next dude is this Thanksgiving turkey. I mean, I even though I'm not in America, I mean, I think this figure is really, really cool. I like these got like chicken man arm pieces from series twelve, but um, yeah, I like that they like use it in a different color. And um, these got like a pumpkin as an accessory. Finally, the only thing is I don't know how he could pick the pumpkin up, so I think it's just like like on the side but i really do love all of the detail and just like everything about this figure it's brilliant next one is the elf girl i mean i think this is really good i mean i just love the new ha elf hair piece that we've got um with ginger hair and like big ears as usual i think that the i believe this is a new elf torso maybe might be wrong on that but i just like everything i also like that they again like detailed a piece which wouldn't have been detailed like they've added like little dots on the glass here for the snow globe i just think that's absolutely perfect the next one i've forgotten what this is called i'm just gonna say 
child toy horse rider i've got no idea if that's the right one or not but i love everything on this i mean i love the armor the horse that goes with it the shields and everything i think you could if you had enough of these because you could start a kingdom or a war who knows next one the nutcracker i think this is an excellent figure so yeah i just love everything like the little headpiece and the just i think it's this is like a really good figure i'm definitely buying some of this when it comes out next figure that we have we have the snowman guy he, this i think this is just like a really cool funny figure to have like if you're building like a winter city this year and you have the snowman figure i think it'd be like a perfect addition i'm not sure lego hasn't leaked this i'm not sure if the snowman dude is snowman is his whole head or if he has a headpiece and it's like a costume but i think it's a really really good figure and the final figure is the candy fairy definitely said that correctly but i just love the like candy cane that she's got included and the crown and the hairpiece and like the wings and like even the little sprinkles on the i just think it's absolutely perfect so my final thoughts on these figures are they're pretty good but a lot of them are festive and i think it was maybe the wrong thing to do to put them all in like the festive sort of section because you've got the elf the nutcracker the sugar fairy the snowman the reindeer so already five out of those 12 figures are festive and then well if you're counting more well, special occasions it's six if you're counting the um the well the thanksgiving turkey but I, man i just thought it was a bit much like lego should maybe re release maybe a separate collectible series which comes out on december but apart from that i thought this was absolutely perfect so tell me what you think down below in the comments like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks. Bye.